News Line right now, Lieutenant Paul Vance, Connecticut State Police. What is the uh, situation your folks are dealing with right now? Well, Keith, we're, we're dealing with a whole host of issues uh, all across the state, as you've been reporting. Uh, certainly there are power outages that are causing issues at intersections, um, some of the secondary roads. Uh, we've had some pooling of water with uh, these torrential downpours and rainstorms that are causing uh, really hazardous driving conditions. Um, the solution to that is simple. Slow down, allow extra time to get to your destination. The high winds are driving the rain and, and you know, knocking down some smaller branches and, and some wires are coming down. So we've got a whole host of issues that we're dealing with this afternoon. This says that from a timing point of view, this couldn't really be worse. As we get into the evening commute, there are going to be a lot of people hitting the roads and... Uh, uh, a couple hours or so, right? Yeah, well, that's a great point, Keith. And we'd ask anyone if they can delay their departure to keep an eye on the weather and, and listen to uh, the reports uh, before uh, heading out. If you do not need to go out, uh, the safest thing is to stay indoors, uh, stay off the roads, and uh, try and ride this storm out. Uh, certainly with the lightning, uh, the possibility of, of branches coming down and power lines coming down and pooling of water, it's a whole host of dangerous conditions for travel. What communities are being hit the hardest right now? That's a tough one, Keith. We've had, we've had issues up in northwest Connecticut, northeast Connecticut, uh, down in Fairfield County. Uh, quite frankly, um, uh, they seem like they're popping up, uh, doing, their, uh, doing their thing, and, and some are eradicating, but then some are popping up right after uh, a second one pops up. So it's, it's been a, a busy afternoon, as you've been reporting. Any thought of bringing in some extra people uh, if this gets any worse? Well, one thing that does uh, is in our favor, if you will, is the fact that we do have our day uh, shift personnel that uh, are staying on duty and our evening shift uh, are coming on duty. So, quite frankly, we've, uh, we've got sufficient manpower to uh, respond to and answer any problem that may occur anywhere in the state of Connecticut. All right, Lieutenant Vance, we appreciate it. Yes, uh, sir.